Now, these microplastics are no longer just in our environment, they are also making their way into our body. Now, microplastics have been detected in the placenta, which means that it can be transferred from mother to baby. It also has been found in the lungs, liver, as well as the kidney, which is kind of very, very disturbing. But what is even more threatening is that in a recent paper published in Nature Medicine, the researchers also detect this microplastic in the brain. And in fact, the levels of microplastic in the examined brain tissue is about 7 to 30 times higher than in the liver or the kidney. Now, to put this into perspective, they estimate that the amount of plastic shard in the brain could weigh as much as that of a plastic spoon. So just kind of imagine it, your, the plastic in your brain roughly the weight as a plastic spoon. That is very, very disturbing. But here is the plot twist. What if I told you the same thing that led this plastic into your body could also be the best shot at flushing it out from your body? And that is 